we can't afford to waste any time here, folks. Uh, but of course, I've got to make sure I keep the noise down as much as possible because otherwise, I'm going to end up waking news. But nevertheless, hello, retro activist Kenzie Retro here. It is 1:36 a.m. Five minutes ago, the trailer for Sp the new trailer for Spider-Man: No Way Home has just dropped. I've got Dan on a Facebook call with me as well. So, let's not waste any more time. Let's get into this. Yeah. Ever since I got bit by that spider, I've only had one week where my life has felt normal. That was when you found out. When you botched that spell where you wanted everyone to forget the Peter Parker Spider-Man. Yeah, and that and that ties into a comic book storyline where he actually did that. We started getting some visitors. Some visitors. From every universe. Green Goblin! <laughs> oh, Black Spidey suit! Alright! Hello, Peter. Dark oh, Ark. You're not Peter Parker. Sorry, what was your name again? Dr. Otto Octavius. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, seriously, what's your actual name? <laughs> there are others out there. Wait, what? Send them back. So, Scooby Doo this crap. You know, all this is kind of your mess. I know a couple of magic words myself, starting with the word please. <laughs> please. <laughs> oh, I love Zendaya. I just saw a big sandstorm there. Sandman's definitely in there. It's their fate. I'm sorry, kid. Yeah, me too. Don't. He learned that. He learned that from Tilda Swinton and Doc, the first Doctor Strange. There's Electro. Oh my word! This Electro looks so much better than the one in the Amazing Spider-Man. That's Sandman! That's Sandman! That's Sandman! 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 As long as they have Thomas Hayden Church reprise that role. That's a callback to Spider Man 3! Oh yeah! What's happening? They're starting to come through, and I can't stop them. December 17th, exclusively in movie theaters. Tickets on sale November 29th, Spider Monday. Where do we even begin with summing up that trailer? Toby and Andrew weren't in it. No. But, but it still looks good. You've got Green Goblin, you've got a much better looking Electro. Sandman's in there. They're, they're saving it for the film itself. I think at that point when Doctor Strange turns around and says, we can't stop it, like everything's breaking. Yeah. They're showing up on the construction site as well. Yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah, but that shot, Doctor Strange saying you can't stop it. If they play that, oh, it, we, people are gonna flip once Danny Elfman's Spider-Man theme plays. And the and then Toby's theme. I mean, look, I mean, look, 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 I mean, look, Toby's gonna be the real money maker from this. No, but the thing is, that Sarah Flash is showing up in the multiverse, and the first thing that they see is Sandman, Doc Ock, Electro. They'll be like, what? 
We've just like, we faced these guys already. Well. The midnight screenings are still going to sell out regardless. Oh, the film's definitely going to sell out because people are going to buy tickets just to see if they're. Yeah, of, yeah, of course, yeah. Because you've got Absolutely. you've got you've got people like us, not just MCU fans, but you've also got those that grew up with the Toby Spidey films when they were yeah, kids. Of Yeah, that, that is still so cool. I mean, Willem Dafoe back as the Green Goblin, that's got to be a given. You've got Alfred Molina back as Doc Ock. You've got Jamie Foxx back as Electro. And like I say, this Electro looks so much better than the one in, in The Amazing Spider-Man 2. But that's just me. He's going to be back as the Sandman. Oh, from the first one, yeah. Yeah, th- we did. We did catch a glimpse of him in the teaser. Tra- in the teaser trailer that got released a couple of months ago, which then leaves that sixth slot for the Sinister Six, unless, unless they might keep that sixth slot for possibly a post-credit scene. Either that, or they're just not revealing who is in that last slot yet. Michael Keaton coming back? Matt Gargan as well, who's in the after credits scene of Homecoming as the Scorpion. Um, oh, that's not a bad show. Mysterio, I, I'm going to call it possibly the sixth member as Mysterio that's going to show up again. J. Joe and Hall's going to come back and he's going to be like... Oh, <laughs> We need to finish this recording and I need to get this up on my channel pronto because yeah, uh, yeah but anyway I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this reaction if you did hit the thumbs up and if you want to be a cracker activist like myself you can hit the subscribe button down at the bottom and click the bell to join the notification squad so you don't miss anything that we do on this channel uh, I'm going to try and get another stream for Falls of Horizon 5 up at some point over the course of this week and there's a new Kingdom of Isolation episode coming up soon as well covering toy story 2 but until then always remember to stay cretroactive